Here's an image you might have seen before. 1986, more than a million balloons in Cleveland's public square, part of an attempt to break a world record. But that spectacle turned into a debacle when the deflated balloons littered Lake Erie and the beaches and the land around the area and also caused some serious accidents. And tonight, almost 40 years later, the Cleveland City Council introduced legislation to ban 10 or more Mylar balloons from being released into the air. Council members say they float into power lines, causing outages. It can also threaten wildlife. Environmental groups say it's a great first step, but they'd like to see a ban on all helium balloon releases. It's a three prong. It's, it's the environmental aspect that, that, that we, can, we can help alleviate. It's the safety, safety issue and it's a health issue. We don't want this accumulating up our food chain or harming the wildlife here. We've done a lot of work in the last few decades to improve our rivers and our Great Lake, and we want to we wanna keep rolling forward. Now the legislation goes to a council committee. Great Lakes area cleanups between 2016 and 2018 found 18,000 balloons and balloon pieces.